Um. What? Hey fellas and welcome back to a brand new video. Captain Flashlands, what do we have to do today? We have to compact our life. And listen dudes, if you haven't already, make sure to leave a like on this video because um, I need it to feed my cat. Oh, anyway, no, but seriously guys, if you hit the subscribe button, leave a like and turn on the notifications, you'll get a watermelon. I don't know what that means. Okay, cool. But Captain Fletchlands, do you remember the last episode? What we did is we actually compacted everything and made everything automated. And as you, as you can see, we've got like... Look at how many, we've got 2,000 logs in this. Anyways, we've compacted all of this into these filing cabinets, which filing cabinets, apparently they can hold like 2 billion items per filing cabinet. And look at this. They only take iron bars and a chest and paper. So to craft paper, it was really easy. All we had to do was um, put some apple leaves in a crushing tub and make sugarcane seeds. And you plant the sugarcane seeds and apparently they have an unlimited grow height. <laughs> Look at this. It is literally raining sugarcane. Captain Fletchlands, I think we may have overdone this. <laughs> Captain Fletchlands and I discovered in between episodes that there's a bit of a system that could literally replace every single one of our chests with these compact chests. And this compact chest builder, dude, it's like, just to build that compact chest builder, you needed two levers, six iron ingots, and a chest. It's it's absurd. And look at how much storage these chests have when you can build them. These chests do take quite a lot of iron. I think they take 64 iron ingots, but we have unlimited iron now. Look at this. All of our chests, I think we had 10 double chests fit in here. But Captain Fletchland's buddy, we have a mission to get on with. So I have prepared a lot of stuff for this video. We are going to completely automate this entire system over here. And instead of it all going into files, it's gonna go into these compact chests. So the first thing that we're gonna craft, now these things, dudes, these things are OP. Packages. Okay, so we've got 25 packages. I think that's enough. We only have 18 machines here, so we've actually got way more than enough right here. That was the first step, right? We've got packages. They're pretty easy to craft. It was just some light blue dye, some furnace and some crafting tables. Now the next thing we're gonna build, dudes, this is legitimately OP. Item ducts. Okay, so we've got all of the item ducts I think we're gonna need, and we've got all of the packages I think we're gonna need. The next thing we're gonna need is combustion chambers. To craft a simple combustion chamber like this, it's just I, like iron, redstone, furnaces, and stone. And listen, I've, I've been farming between episodes. Look at this. I've been busy. I've got tons of stuff to remake some more if we need to. But look at this. We are generating unlimited coal, which is going to therefore generate power in this. Thing is, we only have a certain amount of coal pieces. So what we need to do, so we're going to need to upgrade the speed of the coal production by like a ton, but we're going to need to get mulch for that. So for that, we need cocoa beans and sticks. And guess what we have? Some sticks and some cocoa beans, baby. We have six mulch, which should be okay. We're gonna put the mulch in here. Now the mulch actually grows things faster. And then we've got these coal saplings in here. Boom. So all of those are gonna grow way faster than in here. Look at that. These are already like massively grown. So like these are basically twice the speed. And then this is gonna have a lot more coal pieces in it and it will be able to supply this with way more power. And then we'll be able to have way more actual coal and put it in a chest right here. So this will allow the permanent production of coal to be done. Look at that. We've now got 28 coal in the generator. We should probably actually change this a little bit and put it in a chest or something first, like a compact chest. So I'm gonna continue on with this system. Once I'm done with it, I'll show you guys what it looks like. And then I have a question for you guys. So I've just encountered a small little issue. I've been automating everything here, right? So everything here is pretty much done. I just need to link this up to here instead and uh, compact everything. But there's a bit of an issue with these compactors. Well, it's more the pipes going into the compactors. They only push one certain item until that item is empty, and then they push the other item. But the problem is we need two items at the same time, the equal amounts of the two items, to produce an outcome. Um, the problem is it's gonna fill up this up with iron resin before it fills it up with acorns. So it won't actually produce the iron amber without 
without me manually filling it up with acorns and so on and so forth. You guys get the point, right? But we've got um, the coal pretty much working, but I'm guessing it's going to have the same issue. Yeah, look at this. This one's the opposite. It fills up with acorns before it fills up with resin. So it's not going to have enough time to fill this up. I also had to create one of these wrenches to stop these from interconnecting. So that should, yeah, that should do it like that. So that should send it into this one, right? There's no coal left in here. Why is it not doing it? Relink that. Oh, okay. The coal pieces then did work because that is now gone. All the coal pieces in here are gone. And there's zero coal pieces in here. Okay. So this is powering this. That's fine. Yep. It's working now, I think. There it is. Okay, so it's generating coal, putting it in this chest, putting the coal through this chest into the generator. 26 coal. There we go. Okay, so it's working now. I don't think that's a good sign. That sounded like a lot of explosions. Um... What? I'm sorry. What? You know those explosions we had earlier, right? I have a feeling they may have been a good thing. There is no damage on our entire machine, and we have 11 music discs. I am incredibly confused right now. What did you guys do to make 11 music discs when I wasn't even there? I'll take it. Please comment down below what just happened. Okay, so one more thing we're gonna need to do. We're gonna need to get some cocoa beans, petrified resin, sand resin, and bone resin. So, we're gonna need to create some nickel. It did blow up, which is a very bad sign. Right, okay, that's not good. I'm gonna do a quick patch up job. That'll keep them in for a bit. What I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna, instead of it making iron amber, in between episodes, I'm gonna make it make iron ingots. Then all of these processes will be way easier and hopefully we have an automated process. I'll automate all of these off camera as well. And um, we also need to automate copper a lot more because right now copper is just trash. The system for copper is terrible. If you like, subscribe, turn on notifications. I'm tired. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out everybody.